There was absolute shock in the community after an 18-year-old was shot dead inside uh, David and Mary Thompson Collegiate in Scarborough. He was shot dead after classes ended uh, in school. We spoke to a number of students today who are absolutely shocked by uh, what has taken place. One of them told us how she was in the guidance counselor's office when the shot rang out. Well, I didn't really see much, but I did see students, like right after the gunshot went off, I saw students running out towards the front entrance, and it happened at the back, and I see two hall monitors uh, running towards the situation, and they were talk saying in their walkie-talkies, call 911. And then when she was coming down the road from the school, there were lots of police right. coming. Like 20 cop cars coming down broccoli. It was something you would see out of a movie. I woke up scared, the th whole thing just replaying in my mind over again. I didn't eat dinner last night. No. There is no rational explanation for why a 13, 14, or 15 year old child should have access to illegal firearms, let alone feel compelled to use them. It's really sad what happened, seeing a young male losing his life over whatever he did. I don't know what he did. Uh, basically, it's terrifying. Now, the school was closed today for uh, obvious reasons. This was a, a crime scene. Uh, classes were conducted uh, online, but it wasn't exactly a class uh, setting. Uh, the school board told us that a lot of uh, students were uh, basically taking part in grief counseling and any kind of counseling for people that wanted to talk about their feelings about what they had just experienced. A number of parents obviously concerned about uh, what happened in this school. Uh, a number of them uh, spoke to us outside a community center where uh, they had been told they could gather. I don't know about the security. I'm asking myself, how was this possible? I'm glad she didn't witness it. Shelby's a very sensitive kid. Mm -hmm. Anything that goes on it affects her quite a lot. And last night she was she was not herself. Well, this will offer little consolation to James' family and friends and to the school community at Dave and Mary Thompson. I want to provide some reassurance that the chief, the command team, and indeed the entire Toronto Police Service is deeply troubled by this case. The murder of a young person inside a school where kids should feel safe and secure is shocking to all of us.